this is what we normally call the watch desk. And uh, if, you, if, if you think about it, this is the central hub of where we manage all the operations. That allows us to basically be remote, okay? We don't have to sit overhead 24 seven watching over the habitat and the people inside. And then I'm the one that's backing them up, watching all the life support systems. And they can go to sleep and there's always somebody awake 24 seven watching these life support systems. So from that perspective, it, it makes the operation uh, safer and certainly remote, okay? We don't have to sit right overhead. We have one computer screen uh, where we keep a live chat, and that is number one, a form of communication, but it also serves as an official log of all the events that happen throughout the day. We also have the ability to monitor the oxygen percentage, uh, also the carbon dioxide, as well as the depth. We also have multiple camera feeds, uh, both outside and inside of the habitat. If I see any big air leaks, you know, I, I can catch that. Uh, also on the inside, uh, while these guys are working and are focused on other things, uh, I'm watching the atmosphere on the inside of the habitat and I'm watching all the goings on. This is the uh, daily log that we keep and this is a written chronological uh, record of uh, every event that occurs in the habitat. 43 pages right now and we're about halfway through the mission. That's the bat phone, man. <laughs> The red phone is really a direct line to the habitat where you don't have to dial the number, you just pick it up. Yeah, hey Ryan, can you tell me what the partial pressure is on your entry lock, analog, please? The most rewarding part of the job is, is, is really the result. Usually everything that has been asked of us uh, somehow manages to get accomplished and, and safely. So really, on a daily basis, to me, that's the rewarding part. This being um, the longest mission that Aquarius uh, will, will do in its history. Um, you know, when, when this is all said and done with, uh, I think that's when the magnitude of, of what we, what we're just gonna, you know, what we just accomplished is really gonna hit me.